Okay, it's time to put the memory in. You can see that we've got both cooling units now down on the motherboard. And one of the things that's special about this server motherboard is the amount of RAM slots that we have. You can see that this server motherboard has 12 RAM slots, so it can take 12 DIMMs. Now, we decided to buy um, server memory. And Steve, what is special about server memory? Uh, server memory is usually uh, buffered and ECC uh, corrected, so the RAM itself has uh, error correction built in, so it can detect errors in the RAM. And it's also buffered, so if there's um, any problems, it can actually kind of take over. It's like having extra RAM on the RAM, so it can kind of route around problems. Uh, a little bit like a RAID 1 for RAM. Thanks, that sounds great. Okay, so Brock is putting in the RAM chips, and he's going to go by color. So he's going to first populate all the orange slots and then move on, move his way through. All right, you can see. You can see the, the gap there. If you look on your board, mm -hmm. you can see the gap down. So this is not the right way. So we'll flip it around here. See, you can see the... Mm -hmm. It's not going to work, so you have to make sure you orient the notch. Mm -hmm. Okay. And even pressure on both sides, and they should click at the same time. All right, so you put even pressure on both sides of the stick so that it clicks and you should see the tabs close once it's pushed in all the way, right? Okay. Yeah, they'll, as you apply pressure down, the tabs will flip over the top. And how big are these RAM sticks? These are 4 gig sticks. So this server will have 48 gigabytes of RAM. 4 times 12. Noise. That is a lot of RAM. It will be perfect for serving virtual machines. So this server will serve a classroom full of virtual machines. Going to let another student do it. All right. Get Roy in there. Push. Nice. It's pretty exciting. Pretty exciting, huh? Yeah, this is awesome. Most of this will probably get edited out. Okay, I could hear it snap. All right, that looks good. Good job, Roy. All right, so we got six of the sticks in. Now we're going to populate this side. And I'm going to let other students do this. All right. Hopefully that all vanish. Max, you want to put a stick in? Yeah. <laughs> all right, Max. Here, touch the case. All right, you're good. You're good. You're grounded. Just be careful not to touch the copper. All right, so Max got a stick here. Same way as the other ones? Just yeah. like that. Yeah. Pay attention to where your, your the notch is. is. Yeah, the notch is offset, so it's closer on one side. Then it's not right in the middle, in other words. You see what? Mm. That helps you to orient it to the right way. There we go. So he's got to turn it over. Now you really have to push to get it to close those latches onto the memory. You push straight down. Keep on the outside. Board flexing. Got to push a little harder. Got more. Yeah, you got to use your thumbs right there. Get right on top of it. There you go. There you go. You did it. All right. So now you're going to do the next black slot. Great. You can hear it when those uh, when those hooks kind of close in on the ramp. <laughs> 